Hey everybody, Justin Worden and you are watching What's New in Electronics. We're here on the floor at IPC Apex in Anaheim, California. It's 2024 and I'm back in the chair with Michael Henshaw from Green Circus, man. How are you? Great, thanks for having me. You, know, you guys have been making some pretty big investments nowadays, so let's just get into it. Yeah, we have. Our customers are, are asking that we put a lot more into the business in, in expanding capabilities in the back end so they get more of a, a one-stop shopping effect. Uh, we still do predominantly prototyping, uh, but we've added J standard, the NASA J standard for our aerospace customers. Our, our, they've also come to us to expand our uh, wire harness capabilities, and we added conformal coating this year to, to make sure that we can move faster and get them results quicker than even historical. Well, I mean, it's great for the customer that you have everything in-house, but also from like a business standpoint, right? I mean, you're showing your customer that you're willing to invest in them, which yes. builds loyalty, but also, you guys make money by getting product out the door. We and do. the more you have to outsource, I imagine since COVID, that's become very challenging. It certainly slows things down. And, and many of our customers take our product, take it to other houses to do other pieces of work. And we can now handle that, some of, the, for, some of them uh, in-house. And I, I think they're, their customers are gravitating toward it. It also means that I'm shopping for more equipment. So we're, we're oh, trying no, man. to I'll, build the out what they need. The sales guys are going to start calling right? you after they they're watching are. this. They already um, are. <laughs> but you know, another thing to think about too is like, you, know, you can only control the quality of your product. And any time yeah. someone else touches your product before it gets to the end user, that causes potential issues. You know, I always think about like, you know, the whole Uber Eats thing. It's like, man, yes. I make the best cheeseburger, but it's just sat in some dude's truck for 40 minutes before I got to you. <laughs> That's a fair assessment. And, and we see that when we take product, we ship it out, they take it to their, their coating shop or they take it to another level of inspection or a box build, there's risk of damage. And so it ends up coming back to us for rework. And that's what we're trying to head off for them. Yeah, well, let's talk about this too. I mean, not only are you giving, you're ensuring that your customer is getting a green circuits quality product, mm -hmm. I mean, it's got to help their bottom line as far as the cost they're paying for the total product. Well, the efficiency, and certainly in prototype, their ability to get a quick answer, be able to put it through testing cycles quickly, gets them to production faster, and whatever they want to do with their long-term uh, application for the products. Now, other than, obviously, investing in the equipment, you, know, you guys are always out there. You, you guys provide a very high-quality service. Yes. So let's talk about like the different departments of Korean Circus. You know, it's more than just manufacturing right. boards. Yeah, we do. Uh, we start with design. We can support design any, at any stage, either from a, in a napkin drawing all the way through making tweaks for production. Uh, we'll take it through uh, SMT and then, and then a full prototype PCBA. And then we can do all the back-end inspection. We have dual-side flying probe. We actually have three flying probes. Uh, we can do box build, x-ray, and our, our back-end service offering, I think is what gets a lot of, especially the higher-end customers, that need the extra effort to make sure that what, they, what they're having built performs. Yeah, absolutely. And I mean, let's be honest, those investments cost a lot of money. <laughs> they do. So, they do. Uh, but it, for our customers, that, that's the value we're giving them. We want to be able to make sure that, that when they come to us, they know they're going to get high quality, they're going to get great execution, they're going to get it extremely fast, and they're going to get a service level that follows them all the way from an RFQ through product in their shop. Well, yeah, and even though it may cost you more money on the investment mm -hmm. side, if you can speed up the process, you can put out a better product, you can cut down on the downtime by mm -hmm. having the new state-of-the-art equipment, in the end, you're actually might be lowering the cost for your customer. I think so too, and I also think it's driven a little bit of a change in the nature of our customer. Over the last couple of years, we're seeing a lot more high complexity, medical, aerospace, um, satellites, uh, and, and even to, and defense. So, And we also see a lot more growth in robotics, automation, AI has started to come into the scene, and they're, they have a high demand for our ability to solve complexity and give them a, a high quality product out the door fast. I mean, I think we hit all the check marks on this one. We yeah. covered it all. Technology, <laughs> advancement. Yeah. I mean, you even said AI. So yeah. this, this is a good <laughs> you conversation. You gotta put AI into everything these yeah. days, right? If you don't say AI and data at this conference, you're not, you're not in the right spot. So how can people get a hold of you? Uh, come to us at uh, greencircuits.com and uh, we have our phone lines on the website. Uh, reach out, we'll be glad to talk to you. We'll solve any problem you have. All right, man, I'll let you get back to the show. Great one. Thank, Thank you. Thank you.